Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an important topic that affects all of us. Mobile phone radiation. We'll be discussing the phones with the highest radiation levels, what that means for our health, and how you can protect yourself. Stay tuned to learn which devices you might want to reconsider using. First, let's understand what SAR or specific absorption rate is. SAR measures the rate at which your body absorbs radio frequency energy from your phone. In the US, the Federal Communications Commission FCC, has set the maximum SAR limit at 1.6 watts per kilogram over 1 gram of tissue. In Europe, the limit is 2.0 watts per kilogram over 10 grams of tissue. Now let's take a look at the top 15 phones with the highest SR values. These phones exceed the average radiation levels and might be worth noting if you're concerned about radiation exposure. 1. Motorola Moto G4 and Moto G4 Plus, 1.83 watts per kilogram 1. Motorola Moto G8 Power, 1.78 watts per kilogram 1. Motorola One Fusion, 1.78 watts per kilogram 1. Motorola Moto E6 Play, 1.78 watts per kilogram 1. Xiaomi Mi Mix 2, 1.75 watts per kilogram 1, LG GW 520, 1.75 watts per kilogram 1, Xiaomi Mi A1, 1.75 watts per kilogram 1, OnePlus 5T, 1.68 watts per kilogram 1, OnePlus 6T, 1.55 watts per kilogram 1, Google Pixel 3 XL, 1.39 watts per kilogram 1, Google Pixel 3, 1.33 watts per kilogram 1, Apple iPhone 7, 1.38 watts per kilogram 1, Sony Xperia XZ1 Compact, 1.36 watts per kilogram 1, Google Pixel 3a, 1.33 watts per kilogram. As you can see, Motorola and Xiaomi models feature prominently on this list, but what does this mean for your health? High SR values indicate higher levels of radiation exposure which has raised several health concerns. While there's no conclusive evidence linking mobile phone use to serious health issues, some studies suggest potential risks. Increased Cancer Risk A 2011 study by the International Agency for Research on Cancer classified radio frequency electromagnetic fields as possibly carcinogenic to humans, suggesting a potential link to glioma, a type of brain cancer. Thermal Effects High radiation can cause thermal effects, leading to heating of tissues which might result in discomfort or burns in extreme cases. This is why holding the phone away from your body can be beneficial. Other Health Concerns There are reports of headaches, dizziness, and sleep disturbances associated with prolonged exposure to high radiation levels, though these effects are still being researched. Here are some practical tips to reduce your exposure to mobile phone radiation. Whenever possible, use the speakerphone function or a wired headset to keep the phone away from your head and body. Texting keeps radiation exposure minimal as the phone is typically held away from the body. Shorter calls reduce the amount of time you're exposed to radiation. Avoid carrying your phone in your pocket or close to your body. Use a bag or backpack instead. When you don't need to be connected, switch your phone to airplane mode to stop it from emitting radiation. For those looking for phones with lower radiation levels, here are some models with low SAR values. Samsung Galaxy Note, T-Mobile, 0.19 WKG, Samsung Galaxy Note 2, Verizon, 0.28 WKG, Samsung Galaxy S2, Skyrocket, AT&T, 0.30 WKG, Kyocera Dura XT Sprint, 0.32 WKG, Pantech Discover, AT&T, 0.35 WKG, Samsung Galaxy Beam, Unlocked, 0.36 WKG Samsung Galaxy Stratosphere 2 Verizon, 0.37 WKG. These phones are designed with lower radiation levels making them a safer choice if you're concerned about SAR values. To wrap up, while the health risks associated with mobile phone radiation are still being studied, it's wise to be aware of your phone's SAR value and take steps to reduce exposure. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more informative content. Stay safe and stay informed. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Disclaimer. The information provided in this video is for educational and informational purposes only. While we strive to provide accurate and up-to-date information, the content should not be used as a substitute for professional medical advice, diagnosis, or treatment.
Always seek the advice of your physician or other qualified health provider with any questions you may have regarding a medical condition. We do not endorse any products or services mentioned in this video. The SAR values and health risks discussed are based on currently available data and are subject to change as new research emerges.